And before we look at the burner, I want you to have a look at this. Look at that. I just resoldered this steam line because it was leaking. This is my 50-50 lead solder. It is liquid. That's the effect of the superheater here. This line is so bloody hot, it melts off solder. No wonder the thing always leaks. I'm just going to take the uh, belt off. Anywho, here's the burner. It's nice and secure, thanks to the magnet underneath the steam engine. Not producing an awful lot of fire. Still isn't perfect. Maybe I've got too much packing in it. But anyway, there's that. I guess I'm going to have to take this apart again and silver solder it. Because this is, uh, like I said, that solder's gone liquid. I had no idea we were generating that kind of heat with the superheater. This stuff's still pretty solid feeling here. Not solid. This part here is silver soldered, so that shouldn't melt. There, that's solidified now. Maybe I wasn't running enough steam through it. I'm getting a little too hot. So we're not exactly pulling a pile of revs. So I don't know. I might take this uh, superheater out and just revert the engine back to a straight Jensen 75. It seems to be more of a pain in the ass than it's worth.